Hello and welcome to Brad Iptit. Today we are doing a special cooking edition because you guys have not send, been sending me enough stuff to eat on this here program. Now the details are in the comments below if you'd like to send me some interesting snacks to eat for Brad Iptit. Now uh, actually there's something from Jager sitting at the P.O. Box. Um, I'm going to pick that up and we'll, we'll be eating that next week but for now, I am going to make grilled cheese in a toaster. That's right. Grilled cheese in a toaster, like traditional toaster. Now, I don't recommend this at home because that's actually pretty stupid. You're not supposed to do that. But Malia bought me something called Toaster Bags. Toaster Bags, which... which Toast bags. They let you make grilled cheese in a toaster. So that's what we're gonna do. Since I don't know how to use, I don't. I mean, I know how to use a toaster and a microwave, but you know, grilled cheese in a microwave is not very good. So we're gonna do it in a toaster. Um, yeah. So we have all the ingredients we need. It, I think. I'm not a grilled cheese connoisseur. I have bread. White bread because, I don't know, like, anything toasted, I, I feel like wheat is not the way to go. I like, I like, I like a, I like a, I like a, a white bread grilled cheese. What are you doing, Hyde? Come here, Hyde. Come here, Hyde. Also on the menu, it's Hyde. We're going to eat Hyde. Now, we just got to turn on the burner, like so, and then just roast them. No, I'm just kidding. All right. Um, what's up, Manti? Go away, dogs. I'm cooking here. We also have some cheese. We got some Munster, which I don't know why I chose Munster. I don't know, because I like the name of it. It reminds me of the Munsters. You know, when I was in middle school, I used to slick my hair back, because, you know, I have curly hair, and curly hair is stupid. So I used to slick it back. And people used to call me Eddie Monster, which uh, maybe you need to be old like me to even know who that is. But I don't know, Nickelodeon and stuff. So we're going to get the cheese. I just like it because it looks weird. It's like all, it's got weird edges. See? It's got weird edges. Go away, hide. This is not for you. This is not for you. Go away. All right. And then we have some margarine, some country spread. Because, I mean, that's just easier to spread on bread than butter. And we got some toaster bags. We got the two toaster bags. Because I'm going to make two. In case the first one sucks. That's right. Toaster bags. So let's open the bread. And as we're doing this, as we're waiting for the cook times, like Rachel Ray, I'm going to tell you about all the cool stuff happening this week. Starting today, starting today, rolling with Nolan... At 8 p.m. Central Time, got that good grocery brand bread, grocery store brand bread. Um, Rolling with Nolan 8, he's going to be playing some Shantae and the Pirate's Curse on the 3DS because he has a broadcast 3DS. He might play some other 3DS games as well. Chris Davis usually broadcasts on Monday, but I think he's too busy editing our top 10 videos and Top 10 community highlight videos and stuff. Go away, dogs. Please, get out of my kitchen. Get out of my kitchen. This is not professional. You're dogs. Manti, go. All right. So then you taste... Well, I have very little margarine left. Um, and then you... You put the margarine on the bread like so. Just kind of... Uh, am I doing this right? This doesn't spread very well. The bread's kind of ripping. I don't really know what I'm doing, guys. I'm just going to keep spreading some spread on there. Some country spread. All right. Looks delicious. And um, now it's grilled cheese, so you you put it on the outside, I think, right? All right, let's just put some country spread on there. If I die, uh, I'm giving police permission to release this video if I die in a fire because I decided to cook a grilled cheese in a toaster. So please release this and give all my video games 
to, who am I going to give them to? We'll give them to Carlos because he, he's the one true gamer out of all the people I know. You might not think so, but the man, man has some pretty good taste. He likes paranautical activity and in other games like paranautical activity. And his glasses broke, so he needs the money to buy some new glasses and he can sell my games to fix his glasses. Now, I put the butter on the outside. Now, as weird as this seems to me, you put the cheese on the side without the butter, which is weird. I mean, I may have put too much butter on this. I don't know. Anyways. So Monday, rolling with Nolan. It's going to be exciting. I'm going to go two slices of cheese so it could be extra cheesy. Maybe I put some a little bit of butter on the inside, too. I don't know. Let, let's let's do a little bit because this seems weird. I don't want it to like burn or anything. I don't really know how this works. I'm very low on margarine. I might only be able to make one of these sandwiches. Uh, okay. All right. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Let's just let's just go. Let's just go. Let's put the cheese on there. Two slices of cheese, make it extra cheesy. I mean, how do you close this thing if there's butter on the outside? All right. Anyways, on Tuesday. Tea time with George, 3 p.m. Central Time. He, for the next uh, month or so, is going to be playing some old school GTA games. So tune in on Tuesday, Tea Time with George, to watch uh, him play some um, some um, some old school Grand Theft Auto. I think he might be starting with Vice City, um, which I know is a favorite of a lot of people. I don't know if I'm doing this right. This could be bad news. Um, you know what? I'm going to... I don't, this is freaking me out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna butter some other bread without so much butter on it, cause that's too much, too much butter. I'm gonna, I'm gonna create like a, like a, like a, like a nuclear device here. We'll just spread a tiny bit of butter on there. It's just hard to spread it thinly because it's, the bread's not toasted. Maybe I'm supposed to toast the bread first. I don't know. Anyways, the podcast is also going to be on Tuesday. Uh, but we're going to be doing our, our 2015 preview show where you um, where we, we, go, we go over a big long list of all the games that are announced are probably going to be coming out in 2015. And we, we give our thoughts on them. It's a pretty lengthy endeavor. It'll be a special. We're not going to be talking about the games we've been playing, really. We're just going to kind of be talking about all these 2015 games so show up on tuesday starting at 8 p.m central time get excited get hyped for 2015 i always like these podcasts because i always get to talk about all the games i'm excited about like uh um i don't know some some big games i mean i know there's some obvious ones like witcher 3 and metal gear solid and maybe even final Fantasy 15 but but some 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 of the ones that i'm super excited about that i know a lot of other people probably don't care about one of them is, um, oh, that's a little bit better. One of them is, um, is Codename Steam, which is the, the game that's like XCOM meets Valkyria Chronicles made by Intelligent Systems, the guy that, guys that make Advance Wars. I've been playing Advance Wars on my Game Boy Advance, and I've been super hankering for a, um, for a sequel. I mean, for another game in that series, but since that series doesn't sell that well, I guess they're making something new, but it looks good, so, yeah. Now, I, I put this in this little pocket here. I went butter all over it. Let me, let me wash my hands. Hold on. After the podcast on Tuesday, if we have time, we'll do a Terror Tuesday. But it's probably going to be a, a long podcast since it's special. These usually take us quite a while, so expect a long one. But it's going to be cool. It's going to be cool. On Wednesday, kicking it with Crispy usually starts around 7.30 p.m. Central Time. He is... You know what? I'm volunteering him to play some more Dragon Age Origins because by the podcast, maybe he'll have probably finished up Inquisition. He's at the very, very end of that game. And I would hate to go into these because next week we're going to be doing our 2014 awards. I would hate to, for him to go into the awards talking about Inquisition without having finished Origins, which is the well, it's the superior game. It's just that's a little pouch. It's a little pouch for grilled cheese. Check that out. Check it out. It's a little pouch. And you just jam this thing in the toaster. So kick it with Crispy at 7.30. Who knows what it'll play. And um, 
and afterwards, uh, I think Carlos is going to come over and play some, who knows, maybe he'll play some Alien, because he's fucking Carlos. Maybe he'll play some Paranautical Activity. Um, Thursday, <laughs> fuck, that's yeah, okay, I was done with it anyways. Thursday, um, hey, y'all want to eat some, a little bit of bread, put some butter on it, here you go. Go away, hide. Hide, go away. All right. Thursday, starting around, I don't know, like 5 o'clock Central Time, maybe even a little earlier, I'm going to be broadcasting. Um, probably going to be the last day where I try to squeeze in some 2014 games um, because, like I said, we're doing our awards next week and we're kind of sh starting to shoot our top, t top 10 videos. So who knows what I'll play? I don't know. I'm looking for suggestions. What should I try to squeeze in? Before we do these awards, maybe I'll try to play some of this War of Mine. I heard some good things about that. I don't know. Probably be playing some more Talos Principle. On Friday, you know, let's toast this thing. I don't know what set to put it on, but fuck it. We're just gonna go with what it what it what it's like. Okay, it's toasting in a little bag. I don't know. Doesn't work. This is gonna be a bad video. Uh, I don't know if my toaster's working, guys. This is odd. Um. Oh shit. Hold on. Let me empty out all the crumbs. On Friday at um, 7 p.m. Central Time, Nick is gonna be continuing to play Silent Hill Downpour. As he does. And that's going to be exciting. I know he's excited to play that game. I don't know if this is... Well, my toaster might be... Well, I could try to get out a pan and do this thing for real. <sighs> but that could be a real disaster. Oh, fuck it. I already buttered the bread. What else is there to do? Let me look in the dishwasher here. Do I have a pan? Do I have a pan? I have a pan! And I need a spatula. And I have a spatula. Oh god! This has suddenly turned into a real cooking with bread. Alright. How long is this video going? Yeah, it's getting pretty long. <laughs> Let's, uh, I don't want to run out of memory card space or anything, but. Fuck it, let's go. Canola oil. Let's put a little bit of that on there. Who would have thought the toaster would break? That sucks. Um. So, uh, let's let's do this. And on Saturday, it's the last day. We're gonna be doing. Whoa, well, I don't know what number to put this on putting on four and uh where's the oh we got to get down this little toaster bag thing <laughs> ah ugh. and we'll just put it on there right just put it on the on the on the pan is that how you do it <laughs> i've seen malia do it before but you know what are you gonna do um and uh on saturday on saturday we're going to be doing a special marathon featuring Mwa, where I'm going to be playing games that you vote for. There's a poll I'm starting up again. Your Way Bratterday on a Saturday. You get to vote for what I play on Saturday. There's a poll in the description below. Go vote in that poll. And, um, uh, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. And, um. And yeah, because, you know, Saturday is going to be my big fuck 2014. Let's play some new shit. And by new shit, I probably mean old shit that you're going to be voting on. Maybe it's going to be some Mountain Blade. I don't know. Maybe some fucking Metroid or some shit. Who knows? It's going to be crazy. It's going to be crazy. I do know I, I owe you guys 
some Metroid Prime 2 because that was actually a winner one week, but I couldn't play that for some reason. And I know someone brought it up like, hey, bro, we never got Metroid Prime 2. So I'll probably play that some on Saturday. But, but I'll also be playing what you vote for in the poll. So go vote. And, uh, and yeah, let's get back to cooking this. I don't know what I'm doing. I need to turn the heat up. Oh, God. Oh, God. What have I done? What the fuck happened to my toaster? How am I supposed to make bagels? Maybe it's that outlet. I'll try a different outlet. How about... tell Malia I broke it because I don't think I did. I'm going to flip this thing at some point. I'm going to go ahead and flip it now. Oh, hey! 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 That looks like grilled cheese! Holy shit! That actually doesn't look too bad! Oh my god! Wait. Oh, no, it's sticking. Don't stick. Oh my god! This cooking thing is easy! Who needs a toaster? I was excited about my toaster bags, but I guess I'll have to get a new toaster. Um, I could cook other random shit in there. Where's the thing? Where's the thing? It says on the back you can like, you can like stick a piece of pizza in there. You know, like an old, an old piece of pizza, leftover pizza, some shit. And they're in their dishwasher safe. These toaster bags. Maybe I'll put some Skittles in there and we'll see what happens. Oh man. This is like... Oh my god! It's food! This actually looks pretty good. This actually looks pretty good. Put this shit on YouTube, man. It's fucking... I should, I'd show y'all how to make some fucking grilled cheese. And I already buttered this other bread. I'm going to have another grilled cheese. Fuck it. This one looks about done. I don't know. Looks pretty good to me. Let's eat this. It's hot. It's hot. Uh, what do we got here? Buttered bread everywhere. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this. Grilled cheese! It's grilled cheese! Holy shit! Let's try this. Oh my god. It tastes like food. Oh! Mmm! It's so cheesy! Anyways! This has been a special surprise here on Cooking with Brad Ape Tits. I give my grilled cheese six out of five Ape Tits because it's fucking homemade and delicious. Anyways, send me in some shit for next week or the week after. Have a good week. It's going to be great. Fuck 2015 is coming. 2014 is gone. Peace out, bitches.